Okay, this is the Aubrey antenna that sold online uh, for 2 meter and 70 centimeter handhelds. I put the uh, BNC connector on the SMA uh, so that I could uh, use a different line. I've tested it on the VNA antenna analyzer and it's not cutting it when it comes to uh, being a 2 meter antenna. It does a great job as a 70 centimeter antenna, but uh, um, I thought I would uh, experiment with it. So I took off the, the uh, cap on the tip of the antenna and um, the way I did that was with a butter knife or a dull knife. And once I took the cap off, it was glued on. So I had to put the knife under it and um, get the glue to come off. Popped right off. And, uh, well, I thought I'd show you what I found. It's quite interesting. It's a tape measure. <laughs> what a great idea. A tape measure folded over in half and uh, bolted to the to the uh, adapter at the bottom. Uh, that's what makes it uh, flexible, is just uh, two opposed, uh, or a uh, tape measure folded in half at its center, and then whatever the length is to the bandwidth that you want, you cut it off. I'm sorry, my camera just doesn't focus very well. I'm using my cheaper camera uh, for this video, obviously. And that's what you get. You get a folded tape measure cut to length, covered with heat shrink wrap, goes down to the two bolts that are bolted in and connected to the base of the antenna, which then just goes through um, the bottom here, which is obviously... Uh, a coil. I'm going to open that and see what we got inside there. But I just thought I'd show you this uh, because it's a great idea. You could make your own flexible antenna with uh, old tape measure and some heat shrink wrap and a um, little bit of work. And it'd probably be better uh, because it'll be more exact to the bandwidth you're looking for. Now, what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to stick a piece of metal in the end there and make it telescopic so that you can pull it in and out and I might cut it down a little uh, and then add that telescopic strip of metal to it. it might be copper I'm not sure so I'll make a second video and I'll show you how it's gonna uh, you know come in and out of the center there and you can adjust the bandwidth and we'll throw it on the nano VNA and see if we can improve this antenna a little so that'll be in an upcoming video so I just thought this was a really good idea, uh, turning a tape measure into an antenna, which makes it um, flexible. So uh, I, I'm pretty sure that you'll find this on uh, other videos and stuff like that on using a tape measure. But I just, I just thought it was cool that uh, Aubrey used it and uh, got my money. <laughs> so there you go, guys.